Hello friends, welcome back, hearty welcome to you. In this session, let us see how to find out the rank of a method in shortcut method. Let us take a couple of examples whose ranks we already know. We will try to verify and see how the method is easy and what is the shortcut method. To start with, let us try to find out the rank of care in shortcut method. For that what we will do, first we will write down the word for which we we want the rank that is nothing but C A R E care. Then we will give them ranking ranking according to their alphabetical order. So when we see alphabetical order, A is one, A B C C is two, D E three. After that at the end is R. So we have ranked the alphabets A C R E according to the rank one two three four. Okay. Now what is the what is the this is exactly extension of whatever we are doing in general method but we are going to do it in a quicker way but the logic and the same seems to be same okay what we will do now we will look at the value here the value is 2 how many to the right side how many numbers are less than 2 to the right side how many numbers are less than 2 so we see that there is one number which is less than 2. Similarly, to the right side, how many numbers are less than 1? No numbers are less than 1. Similarly, for the 4, to the right side, how many numbers are less than 4? One number is less than 4. That is nothing but 3. At the end, the last one, it will be 0 because there is no number to comparison. Now, what we do afterwards is we start from the so we know that C A R E is a four letter word. So we'll start with three factorial, two factorial, one factorial and zero factorial. We multiply each one of these and we add them up. And at the end we will add one for the rank of the word. So let us see what is the answer of this. We know that one into factorial three 1 into factorial 3 that is equal to 1 into 6 6 plus 0 into anything is 0 plus 1 into 1 is 1 plus 0 into 0 factorial is 0 plus 1 so answer is 6 plus 1 plus 1 that is equal to 8 let me repeat that again first we will write down the word for which we want the rank care then we will alphabetically place rank them according to the alphabetical order so a will be 1 c will be 2 e will be 3 and r will be 4 now what we will do we'll start from the left to right we will take the first word rank that is 2 now how many words are less than 2 that means indirectly we are asking how many how many words i have to complete how many words I have to complete to go to C? I have to complete all A words, then only I can come to C words. That is nothing but 1. That's why you can see we are multiplying with factorial 3. Why? Because we want all the words starting with A. So it's exactly nothing exactly nothing but whatever the logic we know earlier only. But this is a shortcut method. Okay. So start with C. L right of C, right of C, that is right of 2, less than 2, how many are there? Only 1. Less than 1, 0. Less than 4, 1 is there, that is nothing but 3. And 3, it is 0. So we multiply them according to starting from right to left with 0, or you start with the total number of letters are 4, so start with 3. 3 to 1, 0, you multiply them, you add them, and at the end, add 1 to that. We will be getting the rank. Let us do one more example. Let us take now word mother. I'll write down here M O T H E R mother. Alphabetical order we have to rank them. So let's go ahead and see A B C D E 1 F G H 2 I J K L M 3 N O 4 P Q R 5 S T six so all the alphabets are ranked according to the alphabetical order now what will be the next thing i have to do i have to start from left to right and look what is the rank of m three now how many letters are there which are less than three indirectly how many letters will come in the dictionary before m 
that means e and h will come then only m will come so how many are less than 3 1 and 2 so i'll write down 2 are less than 3 similarly let's go to 4 now how many are less than 4 1 and 2 are less than 4 Similarly, 6. How many are less than 6? 2, 1, 5. So, remember we are always looking towards the right side of the current number. So, if I look from 6, right side is 2, 1, 5. All three of them are less than 6. So, I can go ahead and write 3. Let's go to 2. How many are less than 2? There is only 1. How many are less than 1? 0. How many are less than 5? 0. Now, you know what to do after that. We did that earlier. We start with 0 factorial here. 1 factorial here, 2 factorial here, 3 factorial here, 4 factorial and 5 factorial and we will be multiplying them, we will be multiplying them and we will be adding them. I will not take them because they are zeros directly. Can I put down plus in between? Can I put the plus in between so that we can just add them up and it should come to 309. Let's look into that now. Okay, let's go back. What is factorial 5? 120. 120 is factorial 5. 5 into 420. 23 is 60. 62 is 120. 2 into factorial 5 is 240. Plus factorial 4. 4 into 3 into 2. 4 3 is 12. 12 2 is 24. 24 2 is 48. Next, 3 into factorial 3. Factorial 3 is 3 into 2 into 1, that is 6. 6 3s are 18. Plus, 1 into factorial 2. 2 into 1 is nothing but equal to 2. And at the end, we have, always we have to add 1 for the word mother at the end. So, let's add them now. 240 plus 48 is 288. Plus 18 is 306. Plus 2 is 308. Plus 1 equal to 309. That is nothing but the rank what we know earlier. So this is how you can find out the rank of a word in shortcut method. But remember that this method works only. This exact steps works only when there is no repetition of words. Suppose it is like India or success or let us say something like Mississippi where you have so many letters repeating themselves then how to find out the rank little bit we have to tweak whatever our factorials remaining whatever the first method we did right words how many are there that will be same for the factorial we have to take care of the repetitions that we will see in the next session so just start off sharing with you how to find out the rank of a word in shortcut method which i said that i'll be doing sometime back but due to other constraints i was unable to do so please let me know your feedback on this thanks for your time and support bye for now